Hello everyone, Sigmalator here, and welcome back to Resident Evil. We've completed our Chris playthrough, so now we can begin as Jill. Let's get the full story, shall we? Here we go. Alpha Team is flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle of their mission. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently eaten. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris! Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. We continued our search for the other members, and it turned into a nightmare. There are only three STARS members left now. Captain Wesker, Barry, and myself. We don't know where Chris is. What is this place? Not quite your ordinary house, that's for sure. Hey, Wesker, where's Chris? Jill, no. You don't want to go back out there. But we've got to find... What was that? Chris? No. Jill, go and investigate. I'm going with her. Chris and I go back a long way. All right. You two go. I'll secure this area. Stay sharp.
a dining room. Thanks, Eagle Eye. Okay, the investigation can now commence. Grab these. I'm still a little bit miffed that two of the rooms in my Chris playthrough are left on red. Take a look at this. What is it? Blood. Jill. Nah, that's paint. What are you on about? Tools. I'll be examining this. Let's just hope it's not Chris's. We know whose it is, don't we, boys and girls? Hey, Kenneth. Who's your friend? Lovely. Barry, help! Big boomer gun. I fucking love that magnum. What the hell is this thing? I found Kenneth killed by this thing. Let's report this to Wesker. Yes, let yes, let's do that. We are one hundred percent sure that thing is dead. You two are terrible cops. Good idea. All right, let's do an, an investigate. He wasn't behind the stairs. Barry. Any luck, Jill? No, nothing. What's going on around here? I can't figure <coughs> it out. Same here. Chris and now Wesker. There's not much we can do. We can search for him separately. I'll investigate the dining room again. Okay, then. I'll try the door on the other side. <sighs> this mansion is gigantic. We could easily get lost. Let's start from the first floor. Okay. Oh! I almost forgot. It's a lockpick. You'd make better use of it. Thanks. I may need it. Listen. If something happens, let's meet up in this hall. Got it? Okay. Now, let's immediately, immediately follow Barry into here. I'm not going to check the door on the other side. Why would I do that? And where's Barry gone? He said he'd been here investigating. Liar. Hey, Kenneth, I'm going to steal your tape. Thank you. Ooh, boules. Thank you. Grab the herbs. On the plus side, we get more room with Jill, so shouldn't have to do as much running back to crates like we did with Chris. Yeah, 
Yep, once again I'm going for all the items, clear all the rooms. Hey George. Well, you're not George. We know there's a George around here somewhere. But you ain't him. Yep, we know about that one. I might skip through the files for this run playthrough because they're pretty much the same as they were with Chris. Grab this dagger. And that's him down forever. Apparently not. Push this off quickly, please, Jill. There he is. Let's save our ammunition, shall we? Have a breather. Ah, give me them shotty shells. Thank you. Attach that and use that. Here we go. Don't need to reread these again. Pretty sure I have read all the files in the Chris playthrough, so we should be good. We're just getting Jill's side of the story now. You used the sword key. Why, thank you. Anyone around here? No. Right, don't have any room to pick up items. Fair enough. Let's grab the hanger bullets at least. No, it can't carry the lighter. Let's... Yep, grab that. Hello, mate. Really? Oh, and now you're dead after taking all the, all that ammo? God damn bullet sponges. I bet you are dead now, aren't you? Yeah. 
<sighs> I have a strong disliking of you. Yep, you're not dead. About now. Yep, that's you taken care of. Fair enough. Alright. Yep, we know all about that. Right, health up here. Take those. Oh, I've got shotgun shells this time. Put you there, you there. You there, and I'll take those with me. There, that should be organised the way I like it organised. Grab this. Definitely stock up on this. Grab that herb in a bit. Let's go grab the dog whistle and the lighter. Then we can burn these gits, especially that absolute sponge. Yep, take you as well. We've read all that. Uh, got you. Yeah. How do you know if it's a journal if it's blank? Think, Jill. It might be a novel. Alright. Let's get rid of you. Oh, damn it. And then get rid of you. Right, they ain't getting back up. That's just the way I like it. Right, let's get this map. Yay, I now know where I'm going. Alright, grab these. Grab the red herb. Got a full Healy for my hurt feelies. Cool. Now let's go through the door, please, Jill. Right, drop off some items because we don't need them now. I didn't say we wouldn't be making regular trips to the crates, just we wouldn't be doing it as often because we can carry more stuff. Uh, don't think we need the lighter anymore, for now at least. 
yeah, not until I go upstairs with uh, old Snakey Boy. So, let's go right here, grab this herb, drop that in the crate. If you heard that, that's my roommate's cats. They're having a mad spaz. Okay. Um... No, I actually want to go this way. I forgot my own route there for a second. That's embarrassing. Yep, go through the door anyway, because it's not going to break on us yet. Alright. Now we can... Do the cheats way of getting the shotgun. Ooh, dagger. Yes, because I'll definitely take that because some sponge stole my last one. All right, I think we've got everything in here now. Yes. Uh oh. And this is what you didn't get to see is Chris. door won't open, the door won't open, and then, yes, we've done it right. Oh God, what did I do now? Wesker! Barry! Help! Jill, you in there? Barry? Get me out of here! The door's jammed! Stand back! <clears throat> Grab my hand! <sighs> Ooh, that was tight. Barry. That was a close one. A second late, you would have fit nicely into a sandwich. Really? Doesn't quite have the same charm as the Jill sandwich well, line. Barry, didn't you say you were going back to the dining room to find other clues? I'm glad and all, but why are you here? I just had something I wanted to check. Anyway, we should get back to searching for Wesker and Chris. Thanks, Barry. I owe you one. Don't mention it. Ah, oh, Baz. You can't go back. Why would I want to? In all honesty, the ceiling tried to kill me. Quick, Jill, smash him! There we go. Yeah, I imagine the smell would do that to anyone. Dagger! Thank you. Alright, let's grab the herbicide. 
we'll have to do the same as Chris and come back for the herbs. I want those herbs. I know I didn't use most of them, or basically any of them, as Chris, but I like to collect all of the things. I'll be back for you later, Herbies. Stay strong, stay fresh. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, I saw you, bitch. Damn mutt. Breaking the nice windows. Ooh, bullies. Oh! Head explosion! Not quite as satisfying as when you get it with the zombos, but still. Impressive. Nice job, Jill. Grab the map. Cool. Now we've got the first floor and the second floor. Nothing's going to stop us now. Another dagger. Thank you kindly. Ah, crap. Where's Barry when you need him? Barry. Oh, ba Jill. Baza, what's going on? Other than I'm still alive in this madhouse? No. Can't say it's much safer here either. We'd better secure our escape route first. There's gotta be a back door somewhere. All right then, let's split up again. Hey, hold on a sec. Look what I've found. What? The can of fizz. It's sure to yellow and mellow those things. It's yours. Hopefully you won't have to use it. Ooh, yes. What about you? Oh, don't worry. I like the buddy system we have here. I see. Thanks. I'll take it. See you later. Ciao. Barry does like his guns. Alright, let's go drop some items off, because we're over-encumbered at the minute. Thankfully, it doesn't, expect, it doesn't uh, affect our running speed. As much as I love how this remake refi has refined the, di uh, the dialogue between the characters, I kind of miss the cheesiness of the original. I'm still debating whether or not to play through the original Resident Evil 1 after this one. Or do you think there might be too much Resident Evil 1 in one go? Because essentially the story plays out the same. I don't know. We can have a think about that in due course, but for now uh, oh god, right, uh, Magnum, Magnum Rounds, Grenade Launcher, Grenade Rounds. So we'll take those, 
ditch you, take you. Yes, we're looking good. Make sure we're stocked up. I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigma Later, this has been Resident Evil, and I will catch you next time. Take care now.